there. So she and then Suki finally sees me. And oh my god. Happy motherfucking channel. Hot up in here. You already know what's going on. Listen, if you're new to my channel, go ahead and smash that subscribe button, okay? If you want to see more of this, okay? Period. And click that like button too. Thank you for being on my channel. Listen, well, I got a good story time on the time that I literally spoke to Suki Yana, and this is what she told me, dog. If you already know Suki with the good coochie and been on Love Hip Hop Miami, she she was on Jerry for one episode, and she was in Cardi B's WAP video. If you do not know Suki, you need to know her mixtape just dropped. Will Pussy, it is oh my gosh, like exemplifies 305 music, Florida music, the Florida vibe. If you're from 954 305, you have to support. Go ahead and support my girl Suki's mixtape. It is the bomb. Like, Kind of like bringing back the old Miami Florida base back. But like my favorites on there is Food Stamp Ho, Use the Ho, and Shopping Spree. And you forgot to love me. <laughs> so this the tea, right? So she was having this mixtape release party. Mind you, I was at home all day because I'm just starting a new job. So I'm getting ready to go ahead and start. I have to be there like at 4:30. And all of a sudden, I said to myself, I was like, I wanna go to a party. I checked my phone, right? I see Suki on her Instagram. She posted mixtape release party. Like, whoa, are you kidding me right now? Five minutes away from my house. Like, whoa. It's like she's having a block party now. And literally, I got in mind, I gotta be at work my first day on the job. I have to be there in under like two hours. Oh my gosh, she's having this block party. And I've been dying to meet Suki on her for the longest. Ever since I watched her old documentaries, her old interviews, I've been waiting to see this lady. Like, I love Suki on her. Like, I never met her. So it is gonna be my only chance. You gotta take the opportunity because I don't like what ifs. What if I did this? What if I did that? No, you have to take the opportunity while it's at hand you better get it while it's hot or order it while it's cold period i'm over here in the room i'm sweating my ass off literally i'm putting on a tlc shirt and i got my little uh mexican a uh, short pants on my little sun hat my little shoes my feelers and so i'm already going ahead i'm like okay let me go over there to go say hi take a couple of photos be able to chat a little bit and then be on my way to work that's what i thought and mind you i'm about to literally lose this job that pays ten dollars an hour that's five days a week oh, bro, guess how i get over there like, I go on a bicycle that my auntie had. Because I was I wanted to get there fast enough and not walk in the hot ass sun. Y'all like me and y'all be sweating just as soon as you step out the door. So mind you, Lauder Hill, it is like the hoods of the hood. As soon as I pop over there with my bike, I see there are thugs outside. I'm in the neighborhood full of thugs. And I'm trying to put my head down like, oh, no, no, no. I'm trying to skirt with the pedal, but like, uh-huh, clink, clink, <laughs> clink, clink. Bitch, I'm trying to get to um, Suki's house. I didn't tell y'all my phone was off. So literally, I don't know where this girl be staying at. The maps on my phone was working without Wi-Fi. I was like, thank God. It, it ain't my fault. So I'm over there. I get, I, I'm trying to figure out which is the party. There's one house with her poster on it, but there's another house with a bounce house on it. And then more cars and more people that look like they don't belong in the hood. I'm, I see all these other people that look good. They like they look like they don't belong in this hood. I was just like, okay. So I'm trying to figure out, is it on this side or is it on this side? I don't know. They're just looking at me, like laughing and stuff. I'm just like, the fuck? Like, you know, I don't look bad, but shoot, I just do whatever. Like literally, but I don't look bad. They just looking at me, I'm feeling so uncomfortable because I got this little bicycle with me. Like, you know what I'm saying? So they, you know, looking at me, laughing and stuff. Like it was just, you know, when you someone you feel uncomfortable, it's not your fault. Like people just looking at you and they laughing. I'm just like, oh, I'm over there. I'm just waiting to see. So I see the Sukiana mixtape whoop post, uh, pussy post. I'm just like, yeah, I know that post. That I see it all the time on her Instagram when she be, be promoting her music when she be having skits to promote her music smart marketing move by the way Sukiana period trying to figure out like where is she and then literally time is running down and I'm sweating in the meantime just to be able to uh, meet this amazing hood goddess like period she about to be the revival of Miami base like, yeah, that's pretty big in Fort La in Florida. Like, Miami base. I'm over there. I'm sweating. I'm trying to figure out, oh, my gosh, when is she going to come out? And plus, let, let you know, it's 3 o'clock. Now, I have to be at work at 4.30. And then after a while, like, it wasn't packed at first. So, literally, time is winding down. And I finally see, and they got a big-ass bodyguard outside with a loaded rifle, like, on his thing. Like, it looked like a... It looked like a little purse on him. Like, he was not like, what? I was like, period. I'm glad they had security there. Everything, everything was good. They had food cooking. That chicken was looking so good, but I didn't want to get nothing because, you know, I didn't want to be greedy because you know how your mom say never eat at people's house? That's how you grew up. So that's why you try to not, you know, you pretend like you're not hungry, but you dead ass, like you really want some fried chicken. Like, I wanted some so bad, but I was like, no, I'm not trying to eat. Like, uh -uh, I'm not trying to be greedy. Away. I'm literally over there. Everybody, like, her team is there. I think her hairstylist was, was there. Everything. I see Miami Tip. Y'all know Miami Tip from Love and Hip Hop. That's um, Suki's manager. I was like, oh my God, is that Miami Tip? That's 
when I see my me tip and I was like, hey, my tip was coming. She's like, hey, what's up? How you doing? And then she went on to go inside the house to go um, see Suki in there. That's when my foot gets cut. Like, I don't know what. I think it was the bike when I was walking with it. So as my foot gets cut, I didn't know that I was bleeding. And then people were just looking at me, looking. I'm just like, why do people keep looking at me? Like, uh-uh, like, what, what is going on? Like, what? Like, what is this? Okay. And then they were like, oh, your leg is bleeding. I wasn't trying to pay attention. I was just like, okay, oh, that's fine. Thank you. Like, the, I just feel like if something, if somebody has like, like if a girl's on her period, you're not going to tell her like, oh, you're on your period. Oh, your blood is showing you on your, are you on your period? You're not going to ask her that in front of everybody. So like, literally I was on my period. So I go in the little corner. I go ahead and uh, um, I pat myself down. And then while I'm patting myself down and I got back up, I see Suki finally at the um, house or whatever. And I'm just like, oh my gosh, like this radiant, beautiful Scorpio. I'm just like, damn. Like you can even tell if she had makeup on, like her face looks so clear and that you know she got that tiger tattoo it looks so good on her bro Zuki with that tiger tattoo fierce so i see i'm just like oh my gosh she had that gucci two piece on with those white sandals i was like oh my gosh she looks like trina's daughter like if you want to know who trina's daughter really is that right there um trick and trina's daughter if they were to get together it would be sukiana period all hands down what these not all of the kids look good with their burberry on they know what and then they were just so excited to get in the bathhouse and play and that really made me so happy because it's like they should be so proud of their mom because literally they don't like i was that type of child too you know i remember when i was that kid too getting ready to get in the bounce house and play and just be a kid you know not worry about all this adult stuff all the kids were dripped in burberry what period full price no discounts no discount comes her boyfriend on um, kill bill i keep calling him kill bill because that's his instagram name I'm looking good with his little red bottoms so i go ahead she goes ahead and takes photos with a couple of people i'm just trying to get her, i'm trying to get her hey so I didn't want to bother her or whatever like I didn't want to because I didn't want to seem like a groupie because I would not one thing about me all those screaming fans and stuff that's cool but I will never be a groupie like I'm not gonna be that type of fan that be doing too much just wait my turn you know when she see me she'll see me Suki like oh my god hopefully she remembers who I am or whatever because she reposted me a couple of times on her um story on Instagram so I'm like okay she kind of knows who I am I guess or whatever I don't know and how I worship Beyonce the same way I also worship Suki on I've never seen a couple in Florida that I know be so amazing like that and you know to put their kids first and to really work on their careers and be popping and be happy i've never seen that I'm over there at the party right and then and they said santana was supposed to be this um he was on his way to get there so she and then suki finally sees me and oh my bro, like what the fuck she finally sees me or whatever like i was just like oh my god oh my god hey suki the reason why she didn't get too close to me because i didn't have a mask she is a mother first so she has to make sure she's looking out for her kids because she doesn't know where i've been even though i've been i just came from my house like literally right down the street from where she stay at but she don't know where i've been so i understand that's out of respect so i should have respected her in that way if suki if you're watching this uh please i please i'm so sorry uh, please forgive me um for not having a mask on I did not mean to put you in danger that was my bad just you know so stunned or whatever in the moment like I was just rushing at the house I was just like you know what I'm gonna make this happen I'm gonna make my dreams come true as Suki is approaching me I'm just like oh my god like, what am I gonna say to her when you said when you meet your celebrity or celebrity crush or whatever and you're gonna know exactly what to say to them you just lost for words out of nowhere you're just like damn like fuck what am I gonna say so she comes up to me she's like hi honey how are you I was just like oh my god this is Suki oh, this is really happening right now this is the first celebrity from my hood that I've ever met in my life so she comes she's like hi honey she looks so beautiful she smells so good oh my gosh her hair was like oh god it's flowing in the wind i was so shocked she's literally talking to me like this was not happening right now like she was so not hi honey how are you thank you for coming i was just like hi suki um uh, i kept stuttering a little bit at first he's like yeah i'm the guy that you kept reposting and you followed back on instagram um you know because i love promoting your music or whatever she's like oh yeah i remember you thank you so much she's like how did you get here i was like oh my gosh i literally stay like five minutes away from you like for real, for real like literally five minutes away from you her like really quick like oh um i'm supposed to be going to work today i don't know why i told suki out of my business like she cares like what the fuck but she was so nice y'all like this is like you know when you think somebody's gonna be a certain type of way in person but when you meet them they're a completely different person sukiyana is the same person in person but she's still destiny i was just like oh my gosh so i'm supposed to be going to work today and, and i'm supposed to be making ten dollars an hour i told suki this literally in her face i was like you know what i'm gonna go ahead and see suki at her block party and show her love and, and you know uh, show her love and respect so she knows how much i love her ditch my job for ten dollars an hour just to see her oh you're not gonna get in trouble right and i was like nah like yeah, i'm gonna just give them a run around or whatever i'm just tell them that i was running late or whatever so concerned she didn't have to be concerned she was so concerned y'all she is the sweetest human being i ever met like celebrity wise okay i don't want you to get in trouble last word sukiyana told me literally before i wasn't able to see her again for the rest of the day for the rest of the party she said and i quote you better make that fucking money and it, like what i'm telling her yes i know i'm doing my best she was like thank you so much for coming thank you now and i told her i'm gonna go ahead and change so we can turn up later she was like okay go ahead girl i go ahead so literally i'm going back to my house and i'm like so hyped i'm like oh my god sukiyana just spoke to me i'm just like shabuya shab, shab, shabuya roll call what? so i'm literally going back home 
And then mom is thinking I'm supposed to be going to work, but I was like, no. I'm gonna go somewhere else tonight for work, okay? That's just on period. So I'm literally trying to figure out what I'm gonna wear for the second to for second round. The time I left, I literally, that's when Lauder Hill was packed as a month. Y'all know when Florida be packed on Saturdays? At Sukiana, bro, Sukiana brought the whole hood out. So I literally went back home. I'm calling my auntie that she can bring me back later so I can have a change of clothes to wear. So I literally got my outfit. I got this white jean jacket on. I didn't get to record anything. All I got is a picture of me in Paris right over here. Me and Paris, if y'all don't know Paris' Instagram is gonna be in the link in the bio, that's my girl. She got an EP coming out. Y'all better go ahead and support the EP. That's just on period. I'm trying to go, so I get my auntie to bring me back or whatever. As soon as I come back, everybody and their mama is at this party. Like all the girls on Instagram, everybody is out there. All the people I see from school, I'm just like, what the fuck? Ah, bro, when I told you it was Thugs R Us, the thugs were out. The, the uh, punks were in a clicks or whatever. They were in clicks, the gay boys, they were in clicks or whatever. And then they got the thugs over here, and they got the Instagram girls over here, and they got Suki and the DJ over there. Y'all know that girl on Instagram that's saying, um, it's a 22. PM, PM, PM. He was out there too. I was like, oh, that's the girl from Instagram that do the PM, PM, PM stuff. I was like, PM, 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 PM. And then over there, I see Ball Greasy was over there. He's a Miami artist, if y'all don't know Ball Greasy. And in Santana, he already performed a song with Suki. He performed his song, Walk Him Like a Dog, and Food Stamp Ho with Suki. That's the time that I was still at home getting ready to change. I didn't know it was going to be this pack. Damn, all the boys are out. I'm just like, what the fuck? And literally, I'm literally sweating my ass off. I had to go stand in the shade or whatever to get some shade so I don't be sweating like that. So I'm trying to get Suki out his attention so I can be able to take a photo with her. Now I got a better her outfit on to take you know nice photos and be able to talk to her a little more she can't take no more photos she is drunk i was like damn she said no dude, i, I will i want to take photos with y'all but i am drunk as fuck she was being honest she was like man i'm drunk as hell oh the girl is drunk like give her some space and then santana santana over there I, and then um kill bill was like hey santana's taking photos so suki can't take no photos at all right now but santana's taking photos she was like uh, santana's like uh-uh twenty dollars a pop twenty dollars a pop so the police was thick i tell you when the police were thick in that in lauder hill yeah, last yesterday it was thick as heck for labor day for that block party like for real. i didn't even all i wanted to know is if they had any more chicken then then suki's like yeah y'all gotta go because you know the police is or the police is everywhere and stuff like that so I couldn't take no photo with her, no photo with Santana. Santana was ready to go. Santana, bro, if you haven't seen Santana's ass in person or ass on Instagram, that thing is that Like, damn, I'm just like, whoo, you're not gonna... Santana, you know those bouncy balls you used to play with at kickball back in elementary school? Put two and two together. That's Santana's ass. Like, he had a fat... I'm like, damn. We trying to leave or whatever, and I'll tell you, the thugs were thick up in there. The thugs were thick. I'm just like, God... You finally answer my prayers. I'm just like, okay, I mean, I guess I'm like, uh -huh, which one? Okay. Her boyfriend, he was like, bro, y'all don't, y'all ain't gotta go home, but y'all gotta get the out of here. I was like, yeah, I'm in Paris. I literally am rushing back to work on this bicycle, literally sweating my ass off, and then the job told me that I cannot work today still making an effort to get to work on time like even though i was like literally four hours late i would never do this at a job y'all it's my first day but i was like i'm not, i'm the type of person i don't like what ifs what if i did this what if i did that what if i got a chance to meet suki or santana or whatever able to you know have more time take photos exchange you know positive messages and stuff like that but anyway i am just grateful that i don't have no more what ifs because i beat myself up i'm like damn i should have did this i should have did that no that's why i made the sacrifice to do it because one thing about me i'm a hustler first you know what i'm saying and i'm gonna and i'm gonna make the sacrifice that i need to to make sure my future is better in the five years up and coming so i gotta take every opportunity you gotta get it while it's hot okay you put your hands up in your pocket then you pull out the wallet oh i go back all the way home on this bicycle tell me why i get a flat tire <laughs> Tell me why I get a flat tire on this bicycle. I gotta walk all the way back to my house with this bicycle behind me, trying not to make sure the paddle don't nick me in the back. That is the time that I met Sukiyana. Suki with the good coochie. I wanted to know if they had any more chicken left at her party, okay? Because I didn't get no chicken, okay? Suki, please tell me you got some more chicken. Like, you got some chicken? These food stamps can only do so much, Suki, okay? <laughs> I'm a ratchet ass hoe. A food stamp. If y'all haven't heard, y'all need to go ahead and listen to Suki on this mixtape. Will Pussy, that mixtape is pure Miami, pure Miami based. If you know you got a fat girl coochie and you're trying to get your money, get your hustle on, you need to have this on repeat, and that's just on pure. Y'all go out and get and listen to her mixtape, Will Pussy, on, uh, on YouTube right now, and that's just on pure. Go support my girl, but literally suki she is an amazing person she's a sweet person and she's gonna go far like she's in her own element you know how trina and beyonce and rihanna you know they got their own element that suki she about to be up next and y'all heard it here for suki is about to be big period y'all thank you so much for watching my channel okay if y'all want to see more of videos and story times like this go ahead and subscribe to my channel okay stop playing like you don't want to sus subscribe to my channel okay because it's kind of lit over here uh, just a little bit just a little bit you know just a little bit and just smash that like button for more videos like this okay and it's happy with a good coochie okay still tight it still can grip okay you already know deuces